Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YP Plays Music and today I'm gonna show you guys how to play the C chord on guitar. We started off with the A chord, last week we did the B chord and today we're gonna do the C chord. Next week will be the D chord, of course. Last week the B chord was a little bit harder for a beginner, so this week is a little bit easier than that. We're gonna start off with our index finger on the second string on the first fret. This is a B string. Okay, our middle finger, we're going to place it on the 4th string on the 2nd fret. And our ring finger, we're going to place it on the 5th string on the 3rd fret. Like that. We're not going to play the 6th string, because we are starting off this chord with the 5th one. So it will sound something like this. So the 5 lower strings are played and we're leaving out the 6th one. Okay, so that is the first way to play the C chord and the most common way to play the C chord. If we are taking another option, we are going to recognize this one from last week because basically we have the B chord, but we move one fret up to the right on our arm and we get the C chord. So that's a little bit harder because the B chord was a little bit harder as well. So the B chord that we saw last week but one fret down the arm. So there is a third way we can play the C chord and it's similar to the second way we played the B chord. To use the second option for the B chord we moved up 5 frets, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and then we replaced our fingers up. We're gonna do the same for the C chord. So the second way to play the C chord was here. Similar to the B chord, we move up 5 frets, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But we're gonna take all the strings with our index finger, put a bar over all the strings. Then we're gonna place our middle finger on the 3rd string on the ninth fret. We're gonna place our pinky finger on the 4th string on the 10th fret. Then for our ring finger, we're also gonna place it on the 10th fret but above that on the 5th string, then it sounds like this. Okay, if it's pretty clean. So those two versions of the C chord are a little bit harder as well, uh, but it's handy to know you can play them that way as well. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed it guys, I hope you learned something. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share the video. And don't forget I also have reaction videos and music videos for you to check out. Thank you very much, guys. See you guys next time. Bye.